My friends, welcome back. We're playing as the Moth Swarm, and uh, yeah, we're finally seeing uh, some fleet movement from our enemy. In the in between the episodes, I got myself the Integrated Preservation, which provided us with more maintenance jobs, and I went around and destroyed a few of those maintenance buildings. Unfortunately, also my economy took a nosedive. Not sure why. But, I am sure we will be able to uh, handle this. Where are you going? Here or there? Are you going to remain at the same area? So you are going... So once I'm sure they will go into either of these, I will um, just move all of my fleets into here. Uh, speaking of fleets, two out of... <clears throat> sorry, two out of three are now completely filled meaning we have only one remaining and actually got myself a, a gestalt chamber back now this does worry me a tiny bit uh, the economy is back <laughs> yay and um i was going to say this worries me a lot because one uh, once i move these guys out yeah, I will take a nosedive again with my energy, and that is not something that I'm looking forward to. Uh, other than that, we are just going to build up. We are actually starting to make more volatile modes and ex exotic gases, meaning we can focus more on minerals and upgrading those alloy foundries, but also uh, research. Both of them are extremely important. So, yeah, for now, we just wait over here. Uh, until they get into one of these systems in the meantime we will try to fix whatever is left of my economy also focusing more on like these districts and slow slowly just build it up also food food oh my god food has been um i've, I've neglect neglected food for uh, quite some time here and i will no longer do that so with all of my fleets here that's actually the wrong button. Free fleets. <clears throat> we are about to take a jump. And this jump is going to happen at the minute these guys are just waiting here to jump. And hopefully that is enough to uh, jump right on top of them. They can jump in here, which is okay. Let's take a look. Yeah, they're about to. They're about to. Okay, let's wait. Let's go. And now. Uh, Ascension perk is uh, now available. What do we need? I think food from jobs would be quite ideal right now. Also, what do we get? What shall we get? Is there something new? Uh, we could go for Voidborn. And the Colossus Project, I don't need planetary killers, I really don't. And I don't want to get rid of everything on the planet, since that's food, and that would be bad. The Flesh is Weak, we can't do, that we can't do, Mind Over Matter, we are unable to do, Trend This, we can't do. So, we could go for Master Builders. And... Hmm... I wish that we could go in... Like, uh, this Dyson Sphere would be so nice. We just don't have the Mega Engineering technology. And that is quite upsetting to me. Um, because I could skip these two. Uh, how many can I still get? Like, three. And I could go with the Galactic Contender. Doing more damage against Fallen Empires. And they will come. And just focus on, like, maybe... No, not Defender of the Galaxy. Nobody cares about that. Naval Cap. This is not so important. Um, but I would have to spend all of my points just to get Galactic Wonders, Master Builders. And stuff like that. Because the building speed is just insanely slow. And this would be very ideal. But Galactic Wonders. That would be quite cool. Habitats. I quite like to go into habitats, just so we can focus some of our pops. But right now, I don't think we need to make a selection. We're just going to sit here, wait for these ships all to jump in. And they will jump in. Right about now. And let's go. 
There we go. We'll have a nice fight on our hands. Uh, yeah, I don't like how the uh, the ships just immediately fall back in power. Uh, but still, it should be more than enough. Um, these upgraded ships of the enemy, they are now finally starting to use... Actually, this one's mine. Um, yeah, the Ripper Cannons, they are quite nice. I really, really like those. Where are those... Uh, yeah, there you go, Fightcraft. So, my flag is now finally being utilized. So, quite happy about it. And, yeah, they don't stand a chance, and I'm hoping to destroy quite a good amount of them. Uh, while trying to fix my economy here. Building up a station here. And I know, this is a waiting game. This is a, You would normally play a hive more aggressive. I, I understand, I understand, I'm sorry. Little I can do. So we lost some small ships, nothing too fancy, and they lost actually some battleships, so that's quite nice. And I already warned you at the start of this war that this was most likely going to be a defensive war. Now, with all of those fleets gone, what we can just do is just send them back here. It will take them some time. And try to reinforce to the best of our abilities. Or we just hold off here. So what is your issue? Of course you are the one guy that does things a bit differently than I would like to. Let's start with spawning pool as well as a maintenance. Anyone else? No, but it looks of it we got everything pretty much covered. Now, let us go to our construction ship. You. And do we need a habitat? It's quite expensive. We actually still have a few remaining. What kind of habitats are these? You are energy reactor. Energy reactor. And also, is there no... Come on, man. What kind of planet were you on? What kind of resource were you built on? So it's either going to be like minerals or food. Now, I think it is time that we start colonizing these. Using, of course, our uh, Great Pop. So that's one. That's two. And this is three. Anyone else? There's one over here. We might as well just do all of them. Four. Um, you are not a holy world, right? You're a desert world. So you're quite crap, but... Oh, well. It's fine. You are a holy world, so we don't want to deal with you. So a lot of stuff will go and happen. We got some new point defense. Uh, planetary shield energy, weapons, colonization, speed. Yeah, you know, that would actually be quite nice. And this was a, another upgrade for our research complex. Let us first deal with the ones that we already have. Please, please, guy. Don't rush me. Uh, they got another mega structure bill. We could also look into new battleships since we now have the... Um, the titan slot available so that is something that i want to do eventually not right now uh, we have a lot of things that we still need to work on uh, especially uh, getting these fleets back up into full strength and just making sure that they lose more than we do <laughs> that's pretty much the gist of it um, once they hit a hundred we are going to be starting to move in here and my focus still is getting all the way the way up here to um Tedis. just to uh, make these guys a bit shorter and expanding our realm but economy man I, i've been okay let me be frank here I, I i messed up i just messed up um i started building a lot of hiving districts um just for housing instead of jobs housing and that's nice if your economy works with you but you can see my economy is very fragile very fragile. Uh, what I'm going to be focusing on most likely is just getting a surplus of about two to three hundred of each and five hundred alloys. Because that would be enough. That would be enough for now. And I know there will be some that disagree and I respect that. And if you let that know in the comment section I would respect that even more. Since this has been a um, one way road for this series unfortunately and I, I kind of don't like that. I, uh, I thought about stopping already this series, but with Bannalore so nearby, dedicating 
a slot for another Warband series. I don't think that is the best course of action. How many ships did we actually lose? Well, we lost a good deal of them. I don't like that. Uh, this is so low. <clears throat> then again, what can we do about it, huh? Nothing. Nothing. Um, this, this, just go, just go focus, man. Forget it. Actually, no. Just don't, don't, don't do this. Don't. Be a pal. Don't do this. I don't need you. Because it's 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 not working. Um, I know there. I've I've seen a tweet. Yes, I sometimes look at Twitter. I've seen a tweet. They are working the AI, and uh, and a performance uh, thing as well. Because it's uh, yeah, it's not the way they would like it to be. Let's go and do this upgrade. By the way, why all the way here? Why not here? Because you're building. You know what? I'll. Can we jump? Let's jump there. We'll jump this one fleet. Upgrade him. Hopefully we'll get alloys back. <laughs> I highly doubt it. Um, but we will try. And then our destroyers. Are we'll slowly get our uh, corvettes. Like out or very low to 10. And increasing the battleships. Just to deal. Just get more power. If you look at your fallen empires, they always lose battleships and destroyers. I'm still not fully committed to go with the Titan class. I can deal with whatever is coming my way right now. And yes, the Titan is amazing. That is kind of amazing, right? Damn. Damn, I, I convinced myself. Let's go, get, let's go get the Titan. Get one Titan. One Titan ship is fine. Uh, hopefully we will get some alloys back. But I, I really don't think so. I really don't think so. With all of these ships now being built for colonization. And colony speed is quite up a bit. Uh, we'll, slow, we'll just immediately do what I did over here. Focus. <coughs> you didn't see this. You did not see this. I was going to say I focused on getting these resources, but I didn't uh, because I'm a dumb dumb. I did that over here, and there's now six jobs, and this planet is making just 122. And you know that the next course of action is going to be an energy grid. Just boosting that by 15%, and we can upgrade it and boosting it to 30%. And that is very nice. And then we can do whatever the hell we want. As long as I don't let my AI handle it, I can get this economy back. And we'll just wait and see what will happen with our neighbor. And we'll slowly build this up. Actually, can we just buy more? Yeah. We can. We'll do. How much are we making? Yeah, we're making a good amount here. I like that. One more remaining. But I'll get to that. And that will definitely help my energy. Are you upgrading? 75% and you are upgrading the destroyers. We are apparently gaining more alloys. Which I really like. <clears throat> and we'll start sending you over here. Uh, at the same time. I'm probably going to change. Or actually get the next flip. What happened? What upgrade could you possibly have? Oh well. Let's do it. Let's just do it. He's there anyway, so... Well, why not? 32. So... Yeah, you definitely got lowered a bit. But I think it's the best course of action for now. Uh, might even get a bit lower. Oh, actually, it is an increase. Okay. Well, cool. I like that. So, with all of this done... How long? 73 days. Um, let's just go there. 300 days. I don't see any enemy fleets. So we might as well just take our sweet time for it. Let us... Jump you over there. Then move over there. Reinforce. Fleet is at full strength. Ooh, this is not good. 
Focusing crystal, redolent... Yeah. Oh, actually, I don't care. We don't need this right now. It's extra damage, which is very nice. But uh, we can't really use it right now. Wow, you actually got... Wow, you got a bit of a hit there, buddy. <clears throat> but it's fine. Uh, these guys will probably become equivalent really soon. Uh, how about you? Inferior. These guys, I don't imagine being inferior. You are equivalent. You're the strongest faction in that alliance. So that makes you my next target. It won't be long until that war breaks out. Status quo. Uh, negative 62. I think once this is all done, we are going to move out. Um, at least with one fleet. If we can take all of this, then that would be nice. Who are you, actually? It's this guy. Do you have a gate in here? That would actually you do. You'll have a natural wormhole up to your system. Interesting. How strong are you? You are superior. Oh, that's of course cool. You know that he's going to be declaring on upon me, right? Like, next. <sighs> yeah, yeah, we're going to suffer. <laughs> we'll be suffering. A bit more. Okay, how is all of this going? Looks fine. Forge world. Four jobs. Housing. Amnity. I think there's little we can do for you. <sighs> can we? We can upgrade one of these mega uh, factories, therefore opening another slot. And this is already, these are found, all foundries, right? This is a mega forge, so we want to stay clear of this one. Am I right? I don't know. Let's see. No, they're all the same. Do we need to upgrade? What we need is minerals. <clears throat> Plain and simple, we need more minerals. Pirates must be dealt with. I bet they do. Yeah, we already looked at this. Do we want to do this? Actually, we would do more with less buildings so we are going to upgrade you and i'm going to be demolishing you and i'll do this because otherwise i will forget and i don't like that now we can go and build at the uh, the hive warden so once all of our ships are retrofitted And we're actually building up on alloys again for the third fleet. And we could get a fourth fleet. Maybe that is something that we should be focusing on. Getting another fleet. Just being stronger in fleet power is quite wonderful. 130 due to all of those species just dying. And we still have a few. So I would like to get away that we could close this. Is there a way that we can close all of this? Because I don't need to know that. Like, this zero. Come on, man. Just, just, this is zero as well. Make this the main one, please. I don't care where they come from. Okay? Uh, just make it easier for my face. So I don't have to think. You know? I don't, I, keeping me from thinking would be a plus for everyone. Okay, that's working. Forge World, what's your problem? <clears throat> You could use a house. Well, we don't need to do that right now because we just don't have the minerals. Yeah, we'll just have to hold. <sighs> okay, fine. You you have this building. We might as well utilize it, right? Can't build more, which is a bit of a shame. I was kind of hoping that wouldn't be so. What is your problem? Yeah, stability is quite low. And that is due to also deviancy. 
and we might as well invest in cloning vets although that doesn't work i don't understand why cloning vets actually is under the government tab because it's population growth and that's a government thing okay good but still do we need it also maybe and that's just an idea Uh, this one maybe just go to dieter balanced and the upkeep would be less on food like 50% we will actually be in a plus uh, but I like I like the growth speed I like it as a hive growth speed it, it's it's like holding each other's hand they have to be the same growth for a hive not growing like I'm doing right now usually is a bad thing. <clears throat> so you are done. So let's start sending you over there as well. Still don't see other ships. Meaning we can go and do the same with you. Let's initiate a jump over there and go to the soul system. And we're going to be finishing this fleet completely. We're actually lo uh, not having all of the destroyers here. So 11,000 is the amount of alloy alloys we need. And now all of this is back. Can you... Can you um, sometimes this game, as soon as one of these just hits zero, it will, it, it will just annihilate you. And that's annoying. I really think that's annoying. Mega, okay, that will change that. We do need housing. <clears throat> Apparently, we just they still don't have the uh, the alloys for it. Uh, we'll change that slowly. We'll have to. If we want to survive. Like, how, we're not going to get more housing of this, okay? We have 13 jobs remaining. 13 jobs in minerals, food, and energy. Oh, that's, that's going to take forever. This is still going to be okay. What is your problem? Amenities. Well, that is something I can work with. How about you? Why did my mouse suddenly change? Because is it, is it trying to tell me that I'm over my 20 minutes? No, well, maybe. Once again, not going to focus on this. We will be focusing on minerals. Once we get them. And slowly those minerals will improve and we don't have to wait as much. And we're going to be playing from three times speed. So you guys might not fall asleep. And uh, hopefully you will improve, uh, approve of this. So let's hit the upgrade button. And once they are upgraded we are going to reinforce. We've got two full fleets. The third one is on its way. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you for watching guys. I hope to see you next time. And uh, yeah. Stay safe. Goodbye. Let's uh, make another selection here. Uh, this one. Thank you. Bye-bye.